642 and an upcoming memorial ride will remember a local Marine killed overseas and all those who sacrificed just like him. That's happening in Jackson or Jefferson County next weekend, but our Brooke Slyer is there live now with details. So Brooke, how can people participate? Good morning, Dave. Well, they've made it super easy. All people have to do is show up here to Roadhouse Harley Davidson next Saturday, starting at 11. And joining me this morning is Rachel. She is the sister of Kyle Price, and that's who this memorial ride is in honor of. So you guys have a pretty packed day, you know, to celebrate his life. So go ahead and fill all our viewers in at home. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, immediately following our food giveaway that we're doing in partnership with Cusmano and Sons and uh, United Way, um, you can show up here at Roadhouse for our pre-party uh, from 11 to 2. We're going to have our opening ceremony at 145, and then kickstands will be up at 2.30. Uh, we're going to head out to the Veterans Tribute in Centralia at Kaskaskia, and then we're going to loop through the county uh, back to Woodlawn Bar where we're going to have dinner and raffles and live entertainment uh, by Jeff Bradley and Dave Simmons. Our ride is led by um, our Jefferson County Sheriff, Sheriff Bullard, and local area law enforcement. So, um, you know, really grateful that, that the, the county and, you know, local area law enforcement have been working with us every year, and, and we're really excited to have a little bit more of a, a party here, you know, at Roadhouse, uh, kicking things off from 11 to 2. We're going to have live music here, you know, throughout the lunchtime. There's going to be food available um, and just, a, you know, a lot of opportunities, like you said, a packed day to have a lot of fun. You know, this is a memorial ride in memory of my brother, but um, it's it's really a celebration. You know, you said his birthday uh, is the day before and something that, you know, our family has, has really grown to love is the opportunity to celebrate the living, you know, that he did. And this is in his memory and we miss him every day. But, you know, what a gift it is to be able to celebrate his life and the lives of so many who have, you know, sacrificed for our nation. So, yeah, head on out to Roadhouse here from 11 to 2 for a pre-party. And if you can't make it, you know, early on during the day, you can show up at, at Woodlawn Bar in the evening, grab dinner, hang out. You know, we've got lots of live music, lots of raffles. There is a plenty of opportunities for people to come out and hang out with us uh, next Saturday. And what makes this memorial ride so great, too, is that funds raids go back to scholarships. They go back to other vet groups right here in our community. So a great way to spend it next Saturday. And, of course, I'll have that information on our website a little later this morning. That's WSILTV.com under News 3 this morning. Now back to you in the studio. Well, good Thursday morning to you, Brooke. Uh, staying warm, hopefully indoors this morning. It is pretty chilly to start the day. We've got temperatures back into the 30s in some areas. Haven't seen uh, too many reports of frost, but they can't entirely rule it out. Just